the director and the cast of a film called Experimenter that is in competition at the festival. Director Michael Almereda. Oh, sorry, that's a premiering at the fest premiering at the festival. I knew that. <laughs> Peter Sarsgaard and Winona Ryder, thank you so much for coming to talk about the film with us. So the film is about a series of experiments in that were conducted in the 1960s, 1961, by uh, Stanley Milgram, very famous experiments around the concept of torture. Uh, and so I'm not going to talk about the film. I'm going to let Michael talk about the film. Tell us about what the film is about and why you wanted to make it. The, the movie covers 12 years in Stanley Milgram's Thanks life, in the course of which he did a series of experiments. He was trying to come to terms with the Holocaust, how people um, were obedient to authority. And he also was doing fundamental research for the idea of six degrees of separation. And in the course of this, he had a very exceptional marriage with a woman named Sasha. Winona plays Sasha, Peter plays Stanley. That's the movie. Well, the whole concept is so interesting. I, I, I'm going to pause it, but you tell me if you became interested in this because of the debate that we're having in society around torture. And, and I mean, I understand you're talking about obedience to authority, but uh, I, I, the most famous experiment was when we learned how willing regular people exactly. were to inflict pain on other people. That's right. So I'm wondering if that, that debate that we are having in our society is what led you to want to make this film? The script is, is precedes the most immediate outrage, but when I was writing the script, the Abu Ghraib photos were the most fresh impression about what people will do unthinkingly or blindly, blindly obeying authority. And the unfortunate fact is these, these experiments are, are undyingly relevant. They keep being relevant and resonant, and they keep being a key to understanding what's going on and why we have to question authority more and have try to fill the moral vacuum that is part of our current history. It, Not to be too moralistic about it. No, but, yeah. but I mean, I think these are really necessary, but what a fantastic um, story, way to, tell, to, to talk about those issues. So, Peter, you've had so many incredible performances over the years, and I have not yet had the, the pleasure of seeing this film, so I'll tell you straight up Neither front. have I. Neither of you? No. <laughs> Me neither. I like watching, you know, when I have a film at Sundance, it's a great joy to watch it for the first time with the audience. I know that sounds like bungee jumping. It is a kind of it bungee is. jumping, but it's fun. Yeah, that's a great analogy. But in your case, I don't think you have so much to worry about because you're always delivering something really powerful. Um, tell us about how you approached the character of Stanley Milgram and and why he interested you? Um, he, he, he interested me. His interest interested me. I mean, Stanley Milgram is interesting to me, but you know, to me this movie is like kind of its own experiment in organism and always felt that way to me. It always felt like it was um, going to be different from any movie I'd ever made before and um, require me to do things that I'd never done before. And I guess that's what I always look for is is this going to require a different part of myself? And, um, you know, I'm explaining things that require people to listen. You know, to me, that act <laughs> is, is a monumental one. You know, like in an age where no one pays attention, when every room <laughs> sounds like this yeah. in everyone's head, I mean, this is what's going on in our heads all the time anyway. Um, how do you get people to focus and pay attention to something? And the script just drew me in immediately and had all these complex, interesting ideas, even like that the film was like a box of mirrors or something. And I thought, this is challenging my mind and entertaining me at the same time. That's really what drew me in. What a great thing to do. So um, Winona, talk about your character. You play Stanley's wife. And what is it? What is what? What's the part that she plays in this whole drama? Um, <clears throat> well, uh, uh, I think that, sh you know, uh, they had a really uh, beautiful, close relationship. And um, it, she, she really, uh, what, I, what I liked... What, you know, and appreciated was that it, it wasn't just the wife right. role. Right. Um, she, she was the biggest presence on our set from real life. I mean, you know, we all knew her beforehand. She came to set. She was in the film. You know, I don't know if yeah, she made Sasha, our cut. The woman. The real She's person. in the yeah. film. Yeah.